okay guys welcome to my channel and today i'm going to show you how i did these short faux locks now let's get started so i used a total of seven packs four cuban twists here in 12 inches and three jamaican twist braid in 24 inches and these are the accessories that i bought now as you can see my hair is pretty much finished except these two I'm gonna start off by showing you how to do one what you see I'm doing here is I'm gonna moisturize my hair with some wild goat oil because you want to make sure that your hair is moisturized I'm gonna then use my fingers to part my hair in two then taking one strand of the Cuban twist here I'm gonna place it in between my hair like so interlock my hair over that and then use in an elastic band to secure my hair over the Cuban twist here. Then I'm going to use my fingers to separate that so it's tight on my hair but it's not any tension so don't worry about that. Then I'm going to use my hair and the Cuban twist here and just intertwine that and twist that downwards. Then I'm going to take the Jamaican twist braid, I'm going to use the end and place it on my hair like so. Then I'm going to start to wrap. I'm going to wrap the root about 5 times first before wrapping the hair all the way down the twist. And I'm going to wrap around that twist until it reaches the length of my other locks which you see I'm doing right here. And since it reaches that length, I'm going to then use that here and I'm going to start wrapping upwards. Then I'm going to tie a loop. Use a scissors to snip off that excess here. I'm going to roll it in my hand first. Then I'm going to use a lighter to burn that here and roll it again to secure it. Then at the bottom of my hair, I'm going to clip off that twist, burn my hair, and then roll it again. And this is how the lock should look. And as you can see, it matches up to my other one. Then I'm going to show you how I do that again, but in fast motion. So if you really need to see it in slow motion and me explaining it, you can just skip back a few seconds and re-watch that part. And this is how the second lock looks. Now that my hair is finished, what I'm going to do to loosen up these locks and not make it so stiff is just to place them in some hot water and towel dry them. And then the last step I'm going to do is just accessorize my hair. I use the accessories that I showed you earlier and also some thread and some floss. That's it for the tutorial. Thanks for watching my video and see you in my next one.